okay now let's see uh, it is my Ubuntu command line and we want to create a program on Fibonacci series the first thing you need to do is right here hash exclamation mark slash bin slash bash press enter and now let's start our program now let's say how many numbers you want to print then write echo n equals to okay this will print you like this in this evil screen n equals to question mark means how many numbers you want to get printed okay now here let's see this now you have to read a number read n a variable okay n n is a variable and you want to read and now let's say we want to have five Fibonacci numbers and press enter and then now let's write our program main program now we take two variables and assign it to 0 and 1 let's say a equals to 0 and b equals to 1 and we need a for loop and in bash Linux we need to write like this it's to 0 iteration statement and is less than I will tell you why I'm writing this okay and for for loop to start we need to write do okay c equals to let's say the variable is c and you need an expression evaluation statement which is written like this b plus b and this will add up the two consecutive previous two numbers and, and let's reassign it to a and b the third number okay like this okay and it will repeatedly add up the previous two consecutive numbers and also print it okay it will end up your statement and also you must do like this um, echo a string right echo a string will look like this okay. now let's close the loop by writing done okay and it will print you the Fibonacci series now this way you can print the Fibonacci series in terminal but if you want it into a file then write vi let's name a file let's say fibo.sh press enter and it will create a new file here like this and just type the code as if we did it in terminal I'm writing quickly okay now here is my code okay and you need to press semicolon first thing is you need to have the escape button and then escape colon wq and press enter see wq here is write buffer and quit see in this terminal we have two modes first mode is command line mode and second mode is insertion mode so we were writing code in insertion mode and we are doing this uh, this in command line mode this colon wq is command line mode okay so let's press enter now okay we have saved it with the name feeble.sh and let me execute this code now then write bash feeble.sh enter the user uh, number of inputs 5 and we'll do the same okay and if you are new in my channel you may subscribe to my channel I make videos like this and you can get latest information and updates Okay, thank you.